Hi, John. Oh. Any musician, the two things you want to do is be on tour and be in the studio. You really don't want to do anything else. You know, your life like pines for that kind of those two places. <laughs> Well, the wonderful thing for us uh, um, was bringing in all the different amplifiers and keyboards. We went for gold on this one, eh? Microphones and weird corners in, in the studio. The wonderful thing about SABC studios is that they're huge, and we use that to our advantage. A lot of people, what they do is they record straight into a computer, um, but here we can actually capture the sound of the room and actually go back to that old style recording where you have a mic that's quite far away from the drums or the guitars and so on. So you're actually getting a lot more of the room sounds. And that room has a like, history to it and a feel to it and the instruments and, and even a sound to it. It's inspiring to be in that room. It's inspiring to have all the gear that you've ever dreamed of having and get all the sounds that you really wanted to get. What I want to try and do is use more of the real instruments, so like a Rhodes piano or even a real piano or the Hammond. But I want to go through your guitar pedals delays and, and distortion and so on and try and recreate synthy type sounds but using real instruments. Weeks ago we were doing pre-production at our place in Parkhurst and we got the tempos right and we kind of created a template of the arrangement of the song and now we're coming back in and listening to that template and playing the instruments in the background and then as, as the song kind of starts taking shape here, that template slowly disappears into the background and the new song is kind of taking, you know, the foreground. You come into the studio and you start working with the sounds and it starts opening up a lot more avenue for uh, being even more experimental. So a lot of what the pre-production gave us is thrown out the window because we started doing a whole bunch of new stuff. He left space in the recording for us to be creative and change things and make up things. Totally new thing. Sometimes we reinvented the songs. When you hear those pre-production demos, and you can you can imagine the size of where, where you want it to go, and then suddenly it starts to come through the speakers, and then you, you then you can start hearing more things. So you run in the studio and add another little part or something. Also, because like Nathan said, it's such an organic thing. Like you can have an idea, and then you come with a song, and then you'll be playing. But then you get ideas, and then mm. everything just grows so nicely. It's my it's my favourite part of the being in a band process. Wow, that's really rad, eh? Super rad.